Okay, so today we have a DCM rotary grinder in the shop. Uh, I've got it set up here for you. The uh, machine requires air connection as well as 220 volts, three phase. Uh, a couple of things about the machine. Uh, it comes with a, a paper band uh, cooling system as well as a, a fine uh, additional filter to filter out any kind of grinding particles to keep your finishes on the upper scales of greatness. Uh, 18 inch diameter electromagnetic chuck, chuck control built into the machine itself. Uh, you've got uh, on and off as well as residual. You got switches up here to turn your coolant on and off for setting up and also in the automatic mode. Also the chuck is a variable, uh, variable setting on it also so that you can go from 10% to 100% in strength. Um, the capacity of this machine is 24 inches uh, swing and 6 inches uh, height. The height of the workpiece is uh, the limit is 6 inches. Uh, this also, when unclamped here, there's a pneumatic device on the back that will unclamp this. This can be moved around in different positions and then locked back in place again. Now the machine is used to grind uh, anything from glass, ceramics, um, steel, carbide, uh, and all kinds of different metals. It's a CNC control built by uh, DCM. It's not a G-Pro programming type of thing. It's a menu driven or, pro or conf conversational driven uh, menus that you basically fill out uh, certain uh, blanks on here. It asks you, it indicates that you're missing or what you need. Uh, in the manual mode, you've got a manual pulse generator for bringing the wheel up and down. You've got three different settings. You've got uh, each click here is, I believe, um, 10 thousandths. The finest resolution, this is a, the, the, the Z axis, that's the spindle or the, the, the slide which is going up and down, the vertical slide, that's the Z axis. That's servo controlled uh, with a 1 tenth or 1 10 thousandths resolution. So on your finest setting here, uh, each little click of the dial here will give you a down feed of one ten thousandths of an inch. Um, I'm going to start the spindle up. Again, this is variable speed, 10 horsepower motor. Uh, you put in your speed in your program here. And we have it currently set up so that we can run the spindle and run the magnet with the door open. Generally, uh, you have to have this closed for safety reasons, but just for the video, we've uh, disabled one of the safety switches so we can do this. Also, you notice here is a one-shot lubrication uh, for lubricating the, the slides on the machine, which is only the slide up and down, and also the revolving of the chuck. You've got independent controls uh, of valves here for letting water down on your workpiece or to come through your spindle. Now also with this grinder, uh, you can make a slight adjustment. You can, you can pivot this um, to grind a taper. Uh, there are indicators up here to tell you how much you're moving it when you do do that. And uh, that all that information will be covered in the operator's manual. So uh, that's about all I can say about the machine right now. Uh, one other thing, uh, it has its own a built-in mist collector, an internal mist collector with uh, some filters on the side here that you simply take out and, and clean them every so often, whatever they tell you to do in the manual. The machine is basically all self-contained. Uh, electrics are in here, the coolant goes underneath, and uh, that's, that's it. Everything you program in there, control your, your, your chuck speed, your spark out, your coarse feed rate, your fine feed rate and so on. So that's the, that's the DCM IG180SD rotary grinder. Thank you.